Hey everybody, it's 22 and Party, and I'm here today to show you guys my scarf collection. And I'm also going to be showing you how I like to wear my scarves. There's a few different ways, so first I'm going to show you uh, my scarves. So I put all of my scarves on a big old rack for you guys. So these first two scarves are from Express. This scarf is really glittery animal print. Um, hopefully you can see this when we're very close are. It's got sparkles in it and I think like a little cheetah pattern. And then I've got a tail scarf from Express. I've got a hot pink pashmina, and then a burgundy pashmina scarf. I also have these scarves over here. This scarf was from my friend Jen. She bought it for me for Christmas from Old Navy. I've got this little magenta scarf from Target. I'll print with burgundy from H&M. And then if we rotate here. I've got these two scarves, and I'm not even sure where they're from. They were Christmas gifts for my family. It's just a checkered black, gray, and white scarf. A checkered, like, Burberry-looking one. It's really cute. And then this scarf was from way back in the day. Uh, <laughs> I got this from Air Postal, and it's like a rainbow scarf with, like, little gold sparkles in it. I, don't know, I really like it. And then these two scarves here on the end I just received from one of my good friends, Josie. And you can actually purchase these scarves. She just started a website on Etsy, and she knits these herself. And so um, she gave me some of her little scarves here. They're so cute. And look, she's herself. It's a cute little coral scarf. Knitted, soft, handmade. I love this. I'm going to show you how I'm going to wear it. And then this pattern scarf and a cowl neck. It's got pink, brown, tan, cream. It's just adorable. So I'll also be showing you how I wear this. Okay, so after seeing all my scarves, I'm going to show you guys how I like to wear mine. And I'm going to use a few different ones so you can get different looks, different patterns. And we'll get started. So this is a scarf from Express that I mentioned. It's my biggest one. And it's one of my favorites to wear. And you can wear it so many different ways. But generally, with a longer scarf, I like to fold it in half, tassels at the end, like so, making a loop with your hand. I wrap it around my neck, like this, and then with the loop still open, I tuck the tassels through the loop and pull. Most people like to wear their scarves like this. It just makes it really fluffy and then the tassels are at the bottom. But I like to do this with bigger scarves because they can just be so long and in your way. I like to wear them nice and bunched up. So that's with this scarf. Another idea that I like to do with scarves, and this one's a little bit shorter, but still has the tassels, is this style, where you take it in both hands, wrap it behind you, like so, twist, and then pull it back around. Take your hair out, and just wear it like this with the tassels hanging down and leave it hanging loose in the middle or you can bunch up the tassels in the middle so that it's more collected however you prefer it and there's this another way I like to wear my scarves is tucked in which is a little harder sometimes if you don't have a cow neck already so you kind of have to create one you wrap it around just the same as the other with these hanging Except this time, we are going to tuck the scarf in to the other scarf. This will be a lot better also if you have a little clip, maybe a jewel, of a jeweled pin or something that you don't normally wear. But this makes a cow neck look. You can do have any scarf and just fold it over. And that way when you wear it with jackets, it just hangs out and it's really cute looking. So that's what that looks like if you tuck it in. Another way you can wear a scarf is around your shoulders and then tie in a knot at the center, leaving it more loose. Next one, I'm going to be showing you how to make a bow with your scarf. So you're going to take your scarf around your neck like so. Pull it through just like you're tying a regular shoe. Loosen it up a little bit. 
and then tie a bow. And pull it through. It's a little different, it's a little fun. It's not everybody's cup of tea. And then you have a bow scarf. I think that's really fun and different, and I like the look a lot. Another thing when you have shorter scarves that aren't quite as long as the other ones, you can simply pull it around your neck and pull it through as so when they're not so long. This was a scarf that I got from my friend Josie. It's the really bright one. And another way you can wear it was one of the ways that you see in the movies, just very dramatic looking. You drape it around the back of your neck and then pull it down and let it hang a little bit. Another look that I just learned recently is really fun and interesting. You just wrap it around, pull it in the front so that you have the loop like most of them. And then you go over, under, over, under, over, under the loop, over the loop, under the loop, and then pull. And it makes like a little twisted, almost looks like a little pretzel with the tassels hanging out. And then for scarves that are cowl neck, there's really not much to them. You just put them on and they're ready to go. And this is the cowl neck that my friend Josie also made. It's very knitted and cute. Thank you, Josie. Her scarves run about 10 to $12. They're all handmade, very soft, cute, and I just love cowl neck scarves. So that was my scarf collection and all the different ways that I wear my scarves. I know it was a lot of ways. Hopefully it wasn't too much for you guys. But um, I'm just really into scarves right now. And they're just cheap and affordable and you can wear them all the time. So I hope you enjoyed and learned something. And I will talk to you guys later. Alright, bye.